Welcome back, folks, to a brand new video. In the age of socially distanced vacations, it may be time to forget some of Spain's greatest cities for something a little smaller. In fact, there are so many interesting Spanish villages that I have narrowed it down to just a few. So here are 10 beautiful villages to visit in Spain. So without further ado, let's get into it. Now before you even watch this video, don't forget to hit that like button, obviously for the YouTube algorithm. Number 1. Albarracín Perched at almost 4,000 feet, the medieval war village of Albarracín is pending UNESCO World Heritage status. The castle, main square, the cathedral are the hotspots to see, but meandering through the cobblestone streets and getting a little lost may be the best way to enjoy this village. It's frequently referred to as the most beautiful village in Spain. But I'll let you be the judge of that. Just come ready to climb and please wear appropriate footwear because you will need it. Number 2. Cadaqués One of Costa Brava's most picturesque gems, Cadaqués is located just over an hour's drive from Girona. If the village looks vaguely familiar, it was used as a backdrop by artists. Cadaqués is a beautiful seaside town with a fantastic history that's still visible in its urban architecture. Its old town is a labyrinth of cobbled streets bright white buildings and blue details. But the best way to see Cadaqués is varying viewpoints, so put on your hiking boots and start climbing for an epic photo. Number 3 Home to the medieval castle and fortress, Alcalá del Júcar is perched on a hill overlooking the Júcar River. Besides soaking up the traditional Spanish village atmosphere, make sure to explore the caves, which were built in the side of the mountain rock. Even during the hottest of summer days, it's a cool 64 degrees. So make sure to cross the famous bridge that actually wasn't built by the Romans, but is still a very special piece of historical architecture. Number 4. Hotes. Bathed in moss and surrounded by verdant countryside and mountains, the stone villages of Potes is famous for its arches and the river, which runs right through the village centre. So after enjoying the picturesque old town, you would definitely want to explore the nearby outdoor landmarks, such as the nearby climbing spot and limestone peak. Eating in the village is obviously a must. So don't forget to try the Canterbury specialties like chickpea pies and stews. I can't say that I'll try that myself. Number 5. Kambara Early on in my first year teaching English in Northwest Spain, my bilingual coordinator told me there was one place I absolutely could not miss before returning back to England. That's the seaside town of Cambaro, Galicia's most beautiful fishing village. Featuring the customary Galician architecture, which are homes set upon stilts, you'll find 60 of them throughout the village. Make sure to eat as much seafood as possible, such as shellfish, and some Galician-style octopus doused with paprika. Those are especially revered in the region.
number six, Setanil de las Bodegas. It's not easy to pick the most beautiful village in Andalusia, but Setanil's unique geography make it one of the most impressive. Besides its focal point, a hilltop castle that was once an Arab fortress, the white buildings are built directly into the cliffside rock, resulting in an original cave-like structure that's truly iconic. So make sure to visit one of the bars with outside tables set directly under the rock caves. Number 7. Curiero One of northern Spain's most delightful fishing villages is Curiero, which is bright and compact and backed by green hills and close to beautiful sandy beaches. Make sure to climb up the Garita viewpoint to admire the village and the sea beyond. Now you have to understand there's not lots of activities to do here in Curiero, but that's all part of the thing. If you sit outside and relax, have good local food, chat with locals that enjoy the laid back ambience of the village. Number 8. Dea. A short distance away from one of Mallorca's other incredible gorgeous villages, Bella de Mossa, Dea is set high in the Tramontana Hill overlooking the glittering ocean. Known for its thriving arts and music community, Dea is more than just a historic village. It's also a place for creatives to feel inspired by the mountains, the sea, the beautiful stone buildings stacked along the hill. But despite its small size and population, there are a number of interesting art galleries and boutiques, as well as chic restaurants to check out during your visit. Number 9. Guadalupe. The highlight of this tiny village of 2,000 inhabitants is the monastery of the Virgin Maria de Guadalupe. With its little whitewashed houses and villas, as well as its small narrow streets, this village in Spain is perhaps one of the more traditional looking destinations for you travellers who's looking to find a little bit of Spanish history. And with the famous monastery being the key point, History is indeed what this village offers. Number 10. Poyenza. In the north of the island, there's a scenic old town in Mallorca called Poyenza. It's a very authentic honeystone Mallorcan town which oozes charm. And one of the favourite things to do is just basically walk around the cobbled streets, stopping off at excellent cafes, restaurants and shops to wind down the day. However, it's also worth exploring a little more to discover the gems in the surrounding area. So this is perfect to step away from the hustle and bustle and enjoy a very quiet old town. So there you have it folks, 10 beautiful villages to visit in Spain. You get to see some real nice places, avoiding all the crowds, and you get to experience some real Spanish flavor. As always, be good, be kind, and be careful. Peace.